Hello everyone, today I'm going to be talking about, um, I, uh, I'm going to add on to the, the strategy that I talked to yesterday, where, you know, it's the most expensive strategy. I found a method that is, it's like an add-on, but it, it makes winning, I think it makes even winning a little bit more easier. Uh, so this sim simple method that I'm going to just be adding on to yesterday's video, and then I'm going to show you some examples yeah, it, it, it whether you choose yesterday's method or today's method, uh, it's still the expensive, most expensive strategy. So play at your own risk. It's still going to cost about a thousand per play. So if you follow what I, I go more in detail in yesterday's video, but I just want to talk today about the because what I actually did is I call this the the three doubled combination. It's basically everything that I talked about in the last video. The only difference is you're 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 looking for threes. Uh, you're looking for combinations that have the number three in it, and that it's a double. And then everything else still applies to what I talked about yesterday. So I'm just going to give you guys an example. Go to California. So what you want to do if you're using the online site is you want to look for a double. Now, now remember, you, you still have to do the whole uh, find doubles and then remove all the previous. Uh, you're going to find doubles and then you're going to remove all the unmatched numbers uh, from your previous draw. This is everything I talked about yesterday. So... So what you would do is look for, you're going to, you know, if you're using this app, go use your app because uh, you might find this combination with only maybe two or three combinations per day if you had to go to state to state to find the combination because you you will have to wait it out till you see a double with a three in it. So let me show you what happens when there's a double with the three in it. You can find a, a double with the three in it. I want to try not looking at the numbers. Okay, let's look at this one here. I don't think I saw that number above it. but We have our two doubles, which is a zero, and we have a three in this combination. So use this as a guide, and most likely from what I've seen and what I did is uh, I went and I wrote random numbers down on a piece of paper, doubles that have a three in it, and I saw if the, uh, the next drawing was a a match number and most likely i think it won at like 19 no 19 i think it was like it, it was high the the outcome is high i can't remember the exact numbers i think it was 2010 20 wins and 10 loses or something like that or maybe it was 25 and 5 i'm not sure but let's just see if the next number isn't unmatched okay so that one would have lost so what that was one loss. So let's just look for another combination that has three in it. That's a double. Okay, apparently this app doesn't want me to continue. So let's just go to a different state. Let's go to New York. And then we go find a, a double with a three in it. A double with a, here we go. So we go and we find a double, check. We find three in the in the combination, check. Now usually the next number is going to be unmatched. So let's see if that, and it wins. That's a winner right there. So let's just look for, again, okay, right down here we got the, the seven, three, seven, two. So the seven's the double and three's in the combination. Uh, the next number is unmatched, so that comes out. So let's look again. Okay, this one wouldn't have won. It, it has a three in the combination, and there's four and one. That one wouldn't have won. We need three. Here we go. Here's four, four, three, eight. Four is the double, and three is the double that we're looking for. So let's see. And the next number hits. Okay, so it, from what I can tell, 
it hits pretty frequently. Here we go. Uh, three five nine five. Well, that one that one didn't win. That one didn't win, but still, you're still gonna lose. So let's just look for another number. Looks for a double with a three in it. A double with a three in it. Okay, we go. We got six four on the bottom here. Six four, six three. Six the double, three's in there, and the next number's a winner. So let's look for, I'll do it three more times. We'll see how many times we hit. I'll do it three more times. We've got, uh, here we go. Four's the double, three's in there as well. The next number's a winner. Okay, let's look for another three with the double. Three with the double. Where's a three with a double? And you may have to dig through states to find a combination, or you may have to wait until this actually comes out to, before you play it. Okay, we got this one wouldn't have won. There's there's two threes and zero twos, but that one wouldn't have won. I just try to look for one number that has three in it. I think the, the odds are good when it's like that here we go we got three eight nine three on the bottom here august 22nd okay so three we've had our doubles and then we eight and nine and the next number hits it's unmatched so it's a winner let's do one more one more let's see now this one wouldn't have won yeah uh, we got a four eight three um the next number is a double, but let's do, let's try to find one more winner. Try to find one more winner. So try to calculate how many times I've done this and how many times we're losers, because uh, we'll be able to see how many times you actually win. Do this as yourself, you know, just get a piece of paper, you know, go look for a number that is a double that has three in it. Just look for Look at that number and then just see if the next number that comes out the next day is an unmatched number. And just write it all down on a piece of paper and note down how many times you would win and how many times you would lose. Okay, here's one right here. I think this is the last one I'm going to do. Two, three, six, three. So we got three. We got the double and we got three. The next number is unmatched, so that one would have won. So I, go, I hope you guys understand the strategy. If you guys want to do this for yourself, remember this is not a cheap strategy. This uh, You still have to remove all the, the unmatched numbers from the previous drawings, whichever state you want to do. And then that will narrow it down if you're playing a straight and it's still going to cost. It still costs a lot, but... Uh, this is an add-on to the most expensive uh, strategy, but most effective one I covered yesterday. Remember, please play responsibly. This is still gambling at the end of the day. I'm not responsible for any profit or loss. If you guys like this video, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and uh, tomorrow I will be returning back to my, uh, my predictions. So I just thought I'd make these videos these last couple days. Anyway, I'll see you guys in future videos.